hopefully, the screen capture software can actually capture what's going on on my screen. Well, so far it looks all right. Oh! Hooray! This is also one I've been lobbying for. This game basically describes my life because I actually live in Norland. So, would this be a realistic representation? Or will it be slightly embellished? So, have you played this game before, Arthur? No, I have not. Well... Suppose I'll warn the viewers then. Some content may not be suitable for all audiences. How dare you? <laughs> That's right. Leave everyone if you think you can't handle it. There are most certainly no screamers, Elastor. Oh, there we go. That's the fire button. up the minigame, Arthur. I have no idea how to even play the minigame. Uh, it's either ZX or Space. I think it's just a one button kind of thing. Drinking that beer. It's usually button mashing. Ah, yes it is. So you basically just have to slam on Z as quickly as I can. Got my Earl. I agree. Oh yeah, holding it down works too sometimes. Oh yeah, if you press down on the corpse of an animal, you'll, uh, yeah. you know, harvest them. fly up. See, I thought it was the same thing you thought it was, where you just have to, like, you know, balance between going too high or too low, but you just have to fly as high as possible. But then you're rendered as Icarus. Mm. And you can't really do dodge this on either, it seems. Okay, well, I, I guess... I guess I was wrong, then. Hmm. 
let's just hang out here in the bin for a while. Yeah. Maybe oh. you can go to the left and right. No, but let's wait until the sun goes down. Yeah. There we or go. Or wait until the cloud is over it. Should we mention that pissing on ants is a time or the Swedish tradition and something we do with disturbing frequency? Mm. Well, I'm glad you could, you know, uh, shed some insight or give us insight into the Swedish national psyche, which is clearly a very large theme of this game. It is, really. Basically, this entire game, Norland, is about a super stereotypical person from Norland. I mean, basically, you know how there. I mean, in the U.S., you have southern stereotypes, and you have flying over counter stereotypes, and you have the New Yorker, Bro Brooklyn boys stereotype, and so on. In Sweden, it's basically all Norland, because people in the rest of the country are regarded as fairly normal, but once you get got get up north, people are just completely insane. Oh yeah, and if you want to piss effectively, you just hold Z down. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, there you go. Hang a score. I thought that he had some sort of prostate problem. <laughs> oh shit, cinnamon buns, yeah, and mushrooms, and what the heck is he even eating? Naruto? <laughs> no. Those were, those were cinnamon buns. Traditional Swedish fika. Bird murder. Time for another nap. Murder of them. I think you might have to like go down in this one. Or up. Or not. <laughs> Look and swamp. Picked up a mushroom. Yeah, oh dear. <laughs> Time to masturbate a bit. Oh dear. As we know, it's only Norlanders that masturbate. Oh yeah, you're now banned from Twitch, Arthur. I'm sorry. Oh, if someone reports me, I was about to say. <laughs> okay. But there was a building in the middle of the road, sir. You should probably take it up with the city planning office rather than with me. It sounds like one of my dreams. 
Shit, it just reminds me. Wasn't it one of the freelance astronauts that just drove his car straight into... No, wait. No, no. I it... think I know what you're talking... Is it... Was it a... Oh, this... Rock Tumblr? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And then he, he got just... arrested at Occupy Tools, but... That's neither here nor there. Yeah, but he actually just drove his car straight into a wall next to a road tunnel. And everyone was laughing. Punch themselves in the face in dreams, yes. That is exactly what we do all the time. <laughs> What's that a fucking bear? <laughs> Two dogs, son. Whenever you collect animal parts or whatever, like toe, plate, coal, something like that, what does that mean? Uh, the text that pops up? Yeah. It says, took did the shirt, which means took a bit of meat. Ah. Makes sense. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure how I'm supposed to defeat this bear. Because I can't jump over it either. I suppose it's a QTE to punch it in the face? I think you just got There you go. Oh. There Fuck. Go. Fuck bad. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll be honest. As a general rule, pe we people from Norland do not actually punch bears to death. So how about that new hooked on fishing, eh? I don't know. What, you haven't seen that glorious game? I haven't. Time for another beer. Savor it, bro, savor it. And then speed rank. I don't know, every time I see the Pikmin Javelin or however you uh, pronounce that. All these keep thinking it says, fuck that javelin. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I had that same thought. Well, it's almost right, because Javan is basically a uh, slight misspelling of the Swedish word for devil. I thought you were going to say that javelin is basically a blood-sucking insect. Well, I thought it was already kind of obvious. So he just kept playing Russian Roulette until he died. That's not really a game you're supposed to play on your own, you know. Ah, 
Yeah, I'm so just... sweet, Jonathan. There's absolutely no reward for pissing on more ants, but you just have to. It's part of my cultural heritage, basically. Here we go. The DS8 when it's on its way out and then it gets sucked back in. You have to push it back out. And then it gets sucked back in. Why, Arthur? He really should go see a doctor about that, though. Well, Norlin doesn't have any doctors, as we know. He's out of luck on that end. Hell yeah, here we go. So I'm guessing this won't be uh, going on YouTube anytime soon. That all does depend, doesn't it? Actually, that's a terrible exp translation because what he actually says right there it is feels great to fuck. But I guess the average sensibility is of the American consumer did not allow for that sort of translation. That's exactly how you should feel overflight. I have no idea to actually make how to actually make the knife move, but hold Z. Now it seems to be reacting to me pressing the left arrow button, but I'm not sure if I have to do it with a certain rhythm or just really, really fast. Have you tried just holding it down? Yes, I have, and then it instantly resets. Oh. Maybe you have to alternate? No, no alternating. I tried that also. Ridiculous, seriously. Ugh. God damn it. It's difficult to stab yourself in the head. It really is, at least in this game. It's, it's trying to reflect the, you know, mental barrier you have to get over. It turns out that this is actually real life, and he did actually commit suicide by stabbing himself in the head. This is getting a bit ridiculous, seriously. Uh, let's see here. Someone seems to mention... The trick with the knife is to make sure the momentum never reverts. Once it starts going back, you'll have to wait until it goes back to a starting position and try again. Just tap until your fingers bleed. Imagine how much will power you must gather to stab yourself in the head if you need a reason for why it's a bit difficult. So I was right. <laughs> Honestly, considering how much effort he has to put into it, I really doubt that he stabbed himself accidentally. 
Can I ask you eight questions? Sure. Are you a fag? I'll do bug. <laughs> well, no. Are you lying? Uh... No. Still not lying. Oh shit. I didn't know it ex uh, accepted me and Yah's answers. That's what you're supposed to type, actually. <laughs> well, I typed in Y and N, and it worked. So basically, you have to accept that you're a homosexual and accept. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's terrible. Okay, Arthur, then I have to ask, how in the hell are you still alive, then? Streaming. Shouldn't you have killed yourself by now? Streaming. 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 <laughs> There's two options for Norlanders. Streaming or dying. Yeah. Tough choice when you think about it. Yeah, I know, right? Right, that was Norland. Pretty decent summary. Fun and games. Right. Yep.